Hello Sagittarius, how are you? Welcome to my channel Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So Sagittarius, this is your reading for the month of Jan and this is about what you need to know right now. Okay, so there can be different messages for you guys. There can be some romantic messages, some uh, spiritual messages, personality development, career, money related messages. Okay. Uh, Let's see what comes up. Also, please know that there is an extended reading and the link for the extended is in description box and comment section. In the extended, we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you, what action they will take towards you, what is the likely conclusion between you and this person. Okay, so let's get started now. Now, Sagittarius, uh, I'll shuffle the cards, I'll lay them down and then we'll discuss your energy and... Uh, you will we'll discuss your energy what you need to know for the month of jan okay let's get started remember this is a general reading take what resonates leave what doesn't energies might be vice versa and time is fluid so sagittarius what do you need to know right now sagittarius what do you need to know right now sagittarius what do you need to know right now what do you need to know right now okay so we have ten of swords the lovers hierophant let's discuss these cards first and then, then i'll pull out the rest of them sagittarius what i heard is the battle is over okay there was a battle that you were fighting for some of you i heard that uh this battle was sort of related to some kind of sickness, prolonged uh, sickness, okay? And uh, you're finally able to you are, you have overcome something is what I'm coming is what I'm hearing, okay? this was a battle for you this can be different for uh, all of you uh, for some of you this is a health related battle and uh, this was a prolonged sickness you have overcome that for some of you this can be about some kind of an office politics or maybe you are fighting a legal battle with someone okay and you did not give up till end like I'm hearing that you turned around the situation and finally things are in your favor right now. Okay. It's a 180 degree turn. Initially it looked like you're losing this battle, but you are coming out as a winner at the end. Okay. But of course you suffered a lot in that. There were a lot of emotional financial setbacks. For some of you, this is about maybe some kind of a marriage has come to an end. Or maybe you lost someone in the recent past. Okay. And it was very difficult for you to live without this person. Okay. You you guys had a wonderful life together. But something, fate had something else in its mind. And. Yeah, for some of you, marriage is over. For some of you, I'm hearing that you lost someone. But finally, what I'm getting is the battle is over. So it's a very good thing for you guys. Okay. With the lover's card, I see that universe is, is sort of pushing you to begin the new phase instantly. The more, the sooner you begin this new phase, the, the faster you're going to get out of that battle energy. Okay. And that is why I see that this new phase is, is starting with a uh, with a love opportunity with someone, with someone significant, possibly your future spouse. Okay, with Hierophant, there is there's, this is a committed situation. This is uh, a future marriage situation. Okay, so universe is sort of uh, is like do take take a risk take a plunge take that required uh leap of faith okay 
there is fun there will be none of the situations are perfect there will be some ups and downs but eventually this is a strong situation okay i see two people coming together two people who were looking in different direction are being brought together as what i'm getting maybe this person stays far away from you maybe this person belongs to a different background cultural background different ethnicity your spiritual team is continuously watching you by the way sagittarius okay and this spiritual team is sort of putting you in in a putting you on the right path okay they consider you as a very naughty child in the world of spirituality they consider you as a very naughty child so sometimes by love sometimes by putting you some through putting you uh, putting you through some test they are showing you the right path okay because of the fact that they consider you as a naughty child sagittarius this your spiritual team is a strict teacher by the way okay you have got someone who is a strict teacher so this strict te teacher doesn't mind sometimes punishing you i mean they don't punish you by putting you through some gruesome situations okay uh but i'm also hearing that they want you to understand that it's a wake up call why a wake up call because the battle is again i'm repeating this the battle is over the more the faster you put yourself through uh, a new phase a new situation the earlier you you will get out of some kind of pain that you're experiencing in your life right now okay and i'm also getting that connect with the nature sagittarius the more you connect with the nature the more you surround yourself by nature uh maybe traveling is a very good hobby it is it also acts as as a healer for you guys okay your hobby of traveling heals you to a large extent okay you getting closer to the nature whether it is water whether it is forest okay it it will sort of help you heal faster uh if you're booking a room in whether it is in a hotel or anywhere else see if you can find a room especially when you're traveling vacationing see if you can find a hotel which has a lot of greenery if your room is surrounded by a lot of greenery if you're able to see the forest or the valley from your room try to try to be surrounded by nature okay be in the midst of a forest that will help you heal real real fast or if you can find an ocean view hotel that will be also good for you travel is is a healing factor in your life sagittarius and use that for your benefit you enjoy traveling at the same time you also heal yourself real fast okay what do you need to know what do you need to know right now what do you need to know right now such radius what do you need to know right now we have eight of wands i'm hearing that the messenger is coming with some kind of a news and irrespective of all odds this is coming your way so no one and nothing can stop this so something some good news is coming towards you sagittarius also make sure that you don't talk much about it because people will become jealous pretty fast by hearing this good news about you so don't talk much about it uh 
this good news is something that you are expecting maybe a, a text message from someone maybe uh, you being offered a cup of love by someone maybe a job offer that you wanted and this is this is going to be a very uh, a very good job offer okay like many people were eyeing this offer but it it fell in your lap of course because of your talent and because of your skills that you have the qualifications that you have but this is this offer falling in your lap is kind of a uh, a feather in your cap okay it's kind of an achievement so don't try to make an announcement of that news okay don't try to become flashy about it just be cool just be calm and composed to about about this news that is coming your way don't keep on talking much about it okay sagittarius what else you need to know 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 right now what else you need to know right now what else you need to know right now king of wheels knight of wands and we have the chariot It's quite likely, Sagittarius, that some unusual event is going to happen in your life in the next couple of days. And of course, this unusual event is going to be very, very positive for people who are awakened souls, for people who believe that a different world that a different world other than what we see does exist there is a diff, there is a existence of a different realm on this planet earth if you if you guys believe that if you guys believe in spirits uh, and energies and you know fairies or angels if you guys uh, believe that this uh, this there is an existence of the separate world and if you are someone who is a spiritual pra a practitioner if you are who is who is someone who is religious if you are someone who believes in spirituality and if you are doing some spiritual practices if you are a uh, if you are someone who keeps on meditating uh, regularly if you are doing this for years and years together if you are a tantra and mantra follower and practitioner if you believe that you have connected with the if you have some kind of connection with the spiritual world in such cases there is a possibility that you might see some angels or you might see some you might see someone from your spiritual team okay you will see someone from your spiritual team you will feel the ex not just feel them but i see that you will be able to see them or if you are a believer in someone if you believe in in a god in in a specific god and if you are a worshipper of that god for many 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 years you will get a glimpse of of your favorite god okay you are going to see someone is what i'm getting so that is why i'm saying that you will have some unusual experience and it is going to be the shock of your life but you will be very happy about it also once you see this once this incident happens don't feel like you have achieved a lot in your life and now you should drop or you should slow down in, in your spiritual practice or you should slow down uh, whatever you are doing chanting mantras or anything no don't do that at all no continue doing follow follow your routine about spiritual practices okay 
this this messenger probably this this uh, this angel this god is you will be able to see uh, the reason why you're going to see this angel or this god or your spiritual team is because it will be kind of a symbol for you guys to understand that tremendous amount of monetary abundance is coming towards you okay it's like a popping up of this angel is is kind of a message for you guys to become ready for the abundance that you have never seen before okay knight of wands is Someone is becoming ambitious to win your heart. But I see that this person is aggressively ambitious. Okay. They want to have you in their life at any damn cost. By hook or by crook, they want you. But this person is also coming across as... They... It's, it's a... They want to massage their ego by winning you in their life, by winning your heart, okay? They want to massage their ego. So it's more to, rather than winning your heart, rather than loving you and caring you, it's more about their ego is what I'm getting, okay? So for some of you, you have to recognize who this person is. I don't see, even if any kind of situation happens with this person, I don't see this is going to be a long-term situation. Okay. What else you need to know? What else you need to know? Sagittarius, three of wheels. A collaboration, a long-term collaboration is happening. Either a work-related collaboration or any other collaboration, Sagittarius. What else you need to know? What else you need to know? What else you need to know, Sagittarius? What else you need to know? fool take a leap of faith something that you always wanted to do it's time for you to take that leap of faith page of wands yes a lot of excitement is coming hierophant we have hierophant again so a committed situation is is happening over here okay and it is indicated by multiple cards hierophant lovers all right i hope this resonates and hit like share and subscribe and comment down below the link for the extended is in description box and comment section in the extended we'll see what your person truly thinks and feels about you what action they will take towards you what is the likely conclusion between you and this person all right take care of yourself have a great time ahead Bye bye